this is a sight i love to see your girl went summer smell good shopping today and when i tell y'all i am so excited to show you guys everything that i purchased so let's just get right into it my goal for this video is to make it as short as i can possibly make it because when i tell y'all my hauls used to be like extra long because i would go over a product and go over a product and go over a product thinking that people want to hear that junk and people really want to hear that junk so so the goal is to make this video as short as i can possibly make it because i have a lot of stuff to show you guys good afternoon everyone and welcome back to your girl's channel as you all can tell by today's thumbnail introduction and title i am going to be doing a summer smell good shopping haul now when i tell y'all i never really do hauls anymore like i include hauls in my vlogs and stuff like that but i never really like dedicate videos just to a haul and today I felt like it was so worth it because it's gonna be a summer smell good shopping haul. We all know in the summertime, it is a lot harder to keep our bodies fresh and smelling good throughout the day because we be outside, we sweating, the sun is beaming. And I don't know about y'all, but my sweat be having your girl a little funky. So, if you know me, you also know that I'm the kind of girl that will buy stuff to motivate myself to do things. So, like, you can't tell me. If you went and bought some hygiene products right now, you're not excited to go ahead and get in the shower. Okay, there you go, your answer to your question, if you question it. So your girl went and bought a bunch of new summer hygiene products to motivate me to keep up on my stuff. I mean, at this point, it's becoming an excuse because, I mean, we all know if your girl just had like one half of a dial bar soap and a little chunk of deodorant, I'm going to use all of that, baby, to get myself smelling right. But it just makes it so much more fun when you have like a bunch of cool new products. Like I said, we starting off the summer right with hygiene because that comes first. And I don't know about y'all, but in the... In the summertime, this dang Bath and Body Works bag is so dang heavy, you guys. In the summertime, I don't know about y'all, but my hygiene routine is never the same. Like, I have to go ahead and change my whole entire routine from them other, you know, not so hot seasons to the new hot season hy hygiene routine. I'm doing rambling, okay? The goal was to make this short and quick. So let's get into the Bath and Body Works stuff first. This bag is so big and so heavy because for me, not only do I like for my body to smell good, I also like for my home to smell good, my hands to smell good. So candles, hand soap, you know, plug-ins. But... When I tell you guys, this right here is my favorite Bath & Body Works body wash right now. This literally stays on my skin, has my whole entire room and bathroom smelling just like this. And it lathers so beautifully. This is the Bath & Body Works Fresh Coconut and Cotton Shower Gel. They literally had these for $4 and something today, you guys. Like, are you serious? This smells so amazing and it's so strong. If you are new to my channel, then you do not know that I am very big on a scent smelling good, but most importantly, Importantly, I really want to know if it's gonna last me and if it's actually gonna stick on my skin and make my skin smell good Cuz girl, I don't have time to get in the shower smell all this nice product get out and I don't smell like none of the dang thing Okay, but that body wash baby huh. now same applies for the uh, body sprays and the lotions girl the last thing I'm trying to do is spray a body spray and apply a lotion that I'm not gonna smell an hour later and this is something a lot of people do not know in the summertime, your fragrance goes by like this if you don't put enough on. The heat strips it right away. The odors, the sweat, I don't know, girl, but it strips it right away. And also in the summertime, spray your clothing. The fibers in your clothing is gonna go ahead and hold on to the scent. Not your skin, girl, you gonna sweat that junk right off. The sun gonna beam it right off, baby. Spray your clothes. And not only did I purchase the body wash, but I also went ahead and picked up two of the fragrance mist because this is my favorite, like, when I tell y'all, I use this every single day with like almost all of my fragrances. I have it on today and it smells so good. And I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I mixed it with today. But this fresh coconut and cotton fragrance, when I tell y'all, it smells so good. So this matches the body wash. I didn't see any lotions, but when I tell y'all they have this right now at Bath & Body Works for like $4 and something. And it's so strong and it lasts all day, but it's also a beautiful base for a lot of expensive fragrances. Y'all know I be spraying my uh real perfumes like body spray. And it's expensive so I want to go ahead and like figure out some kind of way to make my real expensive perfumes last longer and my trick right now is using Bath & Body Works fresh coconut and cotton body spray as a base so since I have been using that as a base I went ahead and bought um two other body sprays I bought the pink chiffon this is a very sweet cotton candy you know sugary kind of scent so this is the pink chiffon i'm gonna go ahead and mix this in with like my ralph lauren beyond romance any sweet fragrances or any fragrances that i need to go ahead and add that was fast 
any fragrances that I need to go ahead and add like some sweetness to. And we all know how your girl feels about Into the Night. Into the Night is one of the most beautiful, cheap fragrances in life. This smells extremely expensive. If any of you guys are looking for an expensive smelling expensive smelling fragrance for cheap rush to the semi-annual sale they have these on sale right now for like three dollars and like 75 cents like how and this does last now the weird thing about that fragrance and like the fresh coconut and cotton fragrance is the fresh coconut and cotton when you spray it it doesn't smell as strong as the into the night but the fresh coconut and cotton lasts way longer on the clothing and y'all know i could not pass up the into the night shower gels because girl how the heck could i okay and when i tell y'all i gave bath and body work one of the hugest breaks i gave them one of the hugest breaks i gave them some air i have not been using their products for like a whole entire year and i'm back on their shower gels and when i tell y'all the lather the lather girl i don't know if it's because i use so much soap because i love for my body to feel super clean the thick rich lather i don't know but baby the lather I bought some random hand soaps. I bought Coastal Air. I bought Sun Washed Citrus. And I bought um, Pink Pineapple Sunrise. I'm not going to get too much into the hand soaps. I just like to go ahead and have these on hand. I love that they're like one of the only hand soaps that actually get like the nasty food smell off your hands. One of the worst things in life is to have like food smell on your hands. It makes me feel so dirty. I cannot. I just can't. And I could not forget about Jordan's little sister. So I went ahead and got her the Pink Chiffon Fragrance Mist and the Shower Gel and the Shower Lotion. So Jada, I'm gonna go ahead and drop this off to you, girl. Mm-hmm. Gotta put the little sisters on. Yes, ma'am, because girl, we gotta smell good at all ages. Okay, all ages. Oh, another hand soap. This is BU by Bath and Body Works in the scent Bubbly Rose. Girl, I used to think everybody with a Bath and Body Works hand soap in their kitchen was rich. If you had a Bath and Body Works plug-in, girl, you was rich. I used to just think everybody was rich except for us because we were so poor. When you are so poor, you think everybody is rich. And then when you get some money. You're like, okay, rich. Yeah, they wasn't rich. Because, baby, I ain't rich. And the stuff that I got, I consider to be rich, you know, type stuff. Anyway, I bought some sweet pea fragrance wallflower uh, refills or whatever. Because, y'all know, my house got to smell good. And I ain't going to hold you. These last two days in my home, I don't know what's going on. I don't know if it's because we've been taking Lock It Out more. It's not that my home smells like dog. But my home has, like, this weird smell to it. And I'm not with it. Okay, so... I've been trying to like not burn these Bath and Body Works candles too much because of all the soot it puts in my beautiful white home, white cabinets, white flowers. I but I'm going to have to, girl, and I'm going to have to go ahead and put in all new uh, refills because the ones that I have in my home, these warm vanilla sugar ones, they do not smell good. They have like no scent in my home. My home smells weird. So I got to keep my home smelling good. So I had to go ahead and buy some wallflowers. So these are the fresh cut lilacs. Okay, yes, ma'am. So I got four of those and four of the sweet pea ones. I ain't gonna lie, they be charging for them dang Bath & Body Works plugins, and I don't think they all lack, but I bought them because they was on sale, okay? Like I said, I'm kind of obsessed with their shower gel, so I went ahead and got myself a pink chiffon shower gel. I went ahead and bought myself a Fiji Sunshine Guava Teeny. Okay, girl, this was really fruity. Ooh, girl, I smell that pineapple. Okay, it don't say pineapple, but I smell pineapple. Butterfly. I didn't think I was going to like this new fragrance, but I bought the actual Eau de Parfum um, by Bath & Body Works, and it smelled amazing, so I just went ahead and got this. It was on sale, not by much. When I looked at the little uh, receipt, it said $8 and something. I'm like, girl, I should have put that back, but I bought a body cream. It says raspberry nectar, iris petals, and airy vanilla. Okay beautiful and then i also have the sweet pea body spray right now as a base for some of my fragrances doesn't work too well for that because it doesn't last at all sweet pea they that body spray don't last but i just went ahead and bought the body cream just because you know sweet pea go way back last but not least body care wise i bought the pink chiffon um body lotion and then i had to go ahead and buy two candles because y'all girl I, I can't do the nasty house smell okay and i don't know if it's because it's, it's heat outside so I ain't gonna try to get into it, okay? I got the Endless Weekend Candle. This is, mm, mm, mm. And then this is Laundry Day. Whew, that smells very nice. Okay, girl, it smells like um Suavito. So that was what I got from Bath and Body Works. And what I was personally extremely excited about was the um, fresh coconut and cotton deal I found. And I forgot to use my $10 off coupon um, for the semi-annual sale. So I will be going back buying a lot more of the 
fresh coconut and cotton. And I don't know about y'all, but I actually smell good every single day of my life. So my family never really compliments me because they smell me all the time. So when it's an everyday thing, you're just like, hey, it's regular. So if I receive a compliment from one of my family members, I'm like, okay, that must be a hit. And this dang fresh coconut and cotton, no matter what I wear it with, oh my gosh, my mom loves it. So, girl, this little tiny bag. But the next place I went was Sephora. Girl, I bring my puppy with me everywhere. So I get in there and the lady in Sephora was like, ooh, look at her being so good. Okay, I'm like, yeah, my baby, you good. She is good. Okay, girl, she is good. As soon as I said, oh yeah, she's a pretty good puppy. Literally, when I said that, I started praying. Because Lord knows, sometimes I speak too fast and I got to eat my words. So I started praying, Lord, please let her do good. Because she going to really, really embarrass me. But anyway, I got up in there, y'all. I didn't see much of nothing that I wanted. But I have been obsessed with the fragrance that I'm wearing today. Which is the So de Janeiro Charosa 62 fragrance and I have it on today because I mixed it with my um, fresh coconut and cotton and I don't care how much perfume I spray in the morning time girl I always keep it in my bag just in case I feel like it's wearing off and I gotta go ahead and ooh, 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 freshen up okay girl so this is the fragrance of the day and I had to go ahead and buy another one today because when I tell y'all I'm obsessed I'm obsessed never thought I would even like a fragrance like this okay girl because I'm not really big into the whole you know caramel um what is it even salted caramel pistachio jasmine petals and vanilla girl this perfume hits okay so i had to go ahead and buy another one and it's actually pretty darn strong like it actually lasts now i already know a lot of y'all gonna be like girl why do you be like buying stuff when you're not even halfway gone like when the product is not even halfway gone girl listen it's my mental it's my mental i get it from my mama if we love something we stock up on it just to be like at peace in our mind that we're stocked up it just works that way so like last night i wore this so charosa fragrance or whatever and when i tell you guys i kept smelling myself all nights i was like wow girl like you are really that girl like how do you smell like this and all nights i was looking at the website like should i go ahead and just buy another one should i just buy another one and i was like no i'm going summer shopping i'm going summer shopping i'm going summer shopping tomorrow girl and i'm gonna go ahead and buy me another one because this is fire and when i tell y'all it mixes with my chemistry so well that fragrance may not smell the same on you as it may on me because of our chemistries but it still will smell pretty similar now this is not brand new but i have one on the way in the mail right now as well as the freaking body spray version of this the hair and body mist um i have one of these in the mail right now but i wanted to go ahead and just pull this out of my house real fast and show you guys because this is super important in the summertime i don't know about you guys but when i'm outside whether i'm at like my nephew's game or if i'm outside walking locket or whatever the heck if i'm outside and the sun is beaming on my skin my scalp has like that outside sun burn nasty smell and I don't like it it smells dirty on my scalp but what I notice prevents all of that is a strong dry shampoo and the only dry shampoo that I have found that actually works in the summertime and keeps my hair smelling fresh and not dirty and oily and greasy is this dang Sol de Janeiro Charosa 62 fragrance hair shampoo hair dry shampoo whatever the heck girl this is so fire i put my mama on i put a lot of you guys on and this is absolutely amazing so guess, so guess what i'm gonna do girl if you a loyal one you know in my recent video i bought the bum bum cream i bought the body scrub i bought uh the charosa fragrance i bought the hair oil okay so i'm gonna go ahead and layer all of this girl i ain't got the body wash but i'm gonna go ahead and clean myself up do the body scrub bum bum cream the body spray the perfume the dry shampoo okay i'm gonna be smelling like all over charosa 62 mm and mix my own little fragrance in now all right i always got to put a little twist to my fragrance so that is all that i got from sephora and bath and body works now let's get into the walmart products because y'all know i just had to go ahead and get the basic of the basics at walmart hygiene don't consist of bath and body works and victoria's secret and sephora it consists of going to walmart sometime dollar general target etc etc to get the required stuff all right I told you guys the backstory on why I had to stop using Dial Body Wash and Dial Bar Soap because they were breaking my skin out like never before. And it wasn't like acne, it was rashes. It was rashes like little bitty pus filled bumps. Red, itchy, burn, it was so bad. All over my chest, the Dial products did to my skin. So I stopped using Dial products. Well, recently I was like, girl, I'm getting tired of this because I really do miss Dial. So I tried it out again. I ain't going back, baby. I don't know if I had just got like a bad batch or if Dial like put some bad stuff into the air. I, I, I mean, I don't know, girl, because when I went online, it was a lot of people experiencing what I had experienced. But I tried it again recently and I forgot Dial 
is one of the most important soaps in the summertime and I'm gonna tell you why. A lot of the reason why we still have underarm odor after we done scrub, put deodorant on, etc etc is because we didn't get all of the excess deodorant from the time before and who wants to keep scrubbing their armpits and scrubbing their armpits until they're raw and hurting and sometimes especially me with the amount of deodorant that i apply it's hard to get all of that deodorant off and you can feel if the deodorant is on there or if it's not the only soap that i have found that gets deodorant right off of your armpits old deodorant old silicone film over your armpits is dial it gets it off with like a couple swipes. I am obsessed all over again and it's antibacterial, okay? This is the only soap in life that I feel like so extremely clean that you can't tell me nothing when I get out of the shower. So I'm back on my cheap dial. It's one of the cheapest soaps. Don't use it on your downstairs area. No ma'am, just your body, all right? And then this comes out every single summer. It's limited edition. It is the Dove Summer Care Limited Edition um, Bar Soap. They also have the body wash, but I used way too much of that last summer and I'm not really like interested anymore. But I went ahead and grabbed these because I'm getting back into my bar soap. I always realize how important bar soaps are in the summertime when that odor comes a little stronger and I gotta fight it. So bar soaps get me right. Um, specifically dial so for all my girls out there that's like baby I'm trying to like pinch pennies right now get you some dial bar so baby they got it at uh, Dollar Tree now if I'm being completely honest I know about all the Bath and Body Works strongly scented um, lotions I know about the bum bum cream I know about all of them crazy you know lotions that everybody brags about or raves about but this one is the only lotion that I just cannot stop coming back to when I tell y'all I say that a lot but when I tell y'all, when I tell y'all, when I tell y'all, hmm. I actually finished one of these today. This is the Jergens Oil Infused Hydrating Coconut Lotion. This lotion smells absolutely amazing. It mixes with my chemistry so well and it boosts every single perfume that I wear. Now I know about the whole lotion uh, Jergens recall. I know about it, but baby, I've been using Jergens for years and I ain't really had no problem. So I love my Jergens hydrating coconut. I don't want to say that I'm suggesting it because girl, I like it though. I don't know where I was going with that, but girl, all you need to know is I love that lotion. I forgot to go ahead and show you guys that I did buy more Dial antibacterial soap. Now, the crazy thing, first of all, this lavender and jasmine is amazing. It smells so good. One of my longtime favorites. Um, the crazy thing is we grew up on Dial bar soap because it was all that we can afford, all that we could afford. And it's an amazing soap, but I didn't know how to use it because we didn't really have like the right materials. We didn't have washcloths, we didn't have exfoliating gloves, we didn't have none of that stuff, girl. So all we had was our hands and some loofahs. And the loofahs that we had were so old and nasty and bacterial look that they didn't even get foamy at that point. Like, I'm not, girl, we were so poor. Like, I'm not playing. So, I always use my hands to clean my body. I would go over to my friend's house. They talking about some washcloths. I'm like, y'all are weird. Like, why do you use a washcloth? Who the heck needs a washcloth? Girl, I was the weird one. If I'd have known how to use this soap back in the pole days, I wouldn't have had no hygiene issues. Well, I was using this on my downstairs area because my dad would not buy the girls, like, what they needed for, like, their downstairs area. So, I had to use Dial and I would burn and smell pretty bad, like, every single day. But apart from that, if I'd have known that all I had to do was use a cheap little washcloth, put it inside of it, get it all soaked up and scrub my body, then I'd have been good, girl. I wouldn't have had no issues because we had this in the house. And then I also went ahead and grabbed the spring water. I, I forgot what this smells like, but all I know is I love my dial antibacterial bar soaps okay they all work absolutely amazing but yes all you gotta have is a cheap little washcloth i went ahead and restocked on my cheap washcloths from walmart i ain't gonna lie though when i first started my channel these washcloths were like 245 345 now they seven dollars girl but it's 18 of them so i went ahead and got an 18 pack of washcloths okay they cheap they work good they get your body all soapy and suds up all you need is this washcloth a dial bar soap and wash your body baby oh yes ma'am so i rave about this all the time it is a perfume that i cannot go without this is like my freaking fourth bottle of this junk this is absolutely amazing it is the versace bright crystal perfume i always get mine at walmart so go ahead and restock because they're 70 dollars at Walmart so it's a three fluid ounce you can get it online or at the actual Walmart but girl this is one of my little hacks one of my little tricks girl go to Walmart get your Versace Bird Crystal full size three US fluid ounce okay 
for 70 bucks at uh, Walmart. I'm telling y'all, go to the Walmart website or at the Walmart place. Girl, you get the actual Versace perfume, okay? And that's one of the most freshest summer fragrances in life. I love it so much that I actually went and bought the matching hair perfume on the Macy's website. Now, I bet you this hair perfume is the same formula as the dang perfume. So I could just be spraying that in my hair because this was $50 for one flute out but i love it so much that i actually bought the hair perfume because this is honestly one of the best fragrances in life especially for summer like this can win top fragrance for summertime like i'm not joking i haven't heard one person say they don't like that but they probably gonna flood my comments like bleh, 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 that's disgusting do your thing but i love it okay i love it girl and i suggest it not only do i change my underwear a lot in the summertime i also wipe myself all the time if i've been active if i know i'm super sweaty etc etc i change my underwear i wipe myself all the time now i don't like summer's eve the only summer's eve wipes that i like are the summer's eve fragrance free cleansing cloth now i prefer these over any baby wipe or any like feminine wipes because one thing about those is they're actually saturated in the fragrance free liquid they're actually saturated so it's not like a dry wipe it's actually a good clean you guys and then if you go back and forth a little bit it kind of gets like a little bit of a sud so I use those on my underarms I use those on my behind my downstairs area they're the best they are the best okay but I seen that always came out with some new little uh, refresh wipes so I got the fragrance free cleansing wipes by always always has like some new feminine care products or whatever so I'm like okay girl I'm with it all right so I'm gonna go ahead and try these out you guys see how I like them last but not least my favorite body wash in the summertime especially these last couple summers is the dove refreshing cucumber and green tea body wash this is jordan's like holy grail like oh my gosh when i tell y'all he loves this so much this dove green tea um and cucumber and that's actually what like got us together was him asking me questions about hygiene and skincare etc etc um but yes i went ahead and got this dove refreshing cucumber and green tea body wash now this is another body wash that actually has your skin smelling amazing when leaving the shower and that is the end of today's haul when i tell y'all i am so excited to go ahead and use all of these products like i get so excited when i get new products like i'm not playing like i love hygiene i love smelling good i love receiving compliments that i smell good i just love smelling good girl i love it okay i don't even know what else to say i love y'all the goal was not to make today's video too long so i'm gonna go ahead and head up out of here but that is everything that i bought for my first summing my first hygiene summer trip. Can't talk, okay? Can't talk. Gotta slow down sometimes, y'all. Y'all know your girl be boom, 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 and then my words get ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Okay? I love y'all. God bless you all in the mighty, powerful name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And it's time for your girl to go.